What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Lou back at it again with another my team video. Today's video is on like why I think that the market's gonna crash. As you're seeing right now, 2K let me let me start with LaMelo first of all. So actually let me start with Blake. Blake's coming out tomorrow. Level 40 agenda. I know if you watch the other video, you know like he's gonna be an agenda group, so I'm guessing it's gonna be like I don't know if you guys remember, but in December, they did like a week one, week two, week three, week four, week five, all the way up to a Galaxy Opal. And then that Galaxy Opal was like uh, Clyde Drexler. It was like part of the, what was that event called? Wait, hold up. I have it right here. The Age of Heroes, where like Doc, not Doc, Greg Popovich and all of them were the rewards. Well, I think it's going to be like that. It's going to be set up in agendas like that, but you're not going to need Luka. And they're going to keep... It's going to be... It might be time. They might mess it up because I feel like 2K does that. But the next card that's going to break the game... Because you already know this Lamelo is going to be point guard. And they're going to juice him like a mofo. What's his other card right now? Let me see. What's his other card? 2K database real quick. Lamelo Ball. The last one we got was a Diamond. And he's 6, 7, 6, 10, and people were running him in triple threat. And he was a monster. You can only imagine how much, how many. This was in December, or like, this is the first out of position. 26 Hall of Fame badges on a guard. If these are his stats, his dark matter is going to be insane. Like, I'm telling you right now, this would probably be one of the best point guards to have. If they give him enough, like, defense, because they're probably going to boost this up to, like, 95, I'm guessing, on both. And give him every badge except blinders. And I, if I pull him, Lamelo, uh, if you get, if you pull Lamelo and he doesn't come with blinders, and you have blinders Hall of Fame, you put him on him and put him on the auction block. I promise you, you're making bank. You are making bank. They're probably gonna keep his same shot, which I hope they do, because his shot is butter. And it's already very quick. They're gonna have curry slide. They're gonna have all that. I'll be reviewing all these cards tomorrow. But that card is coming out. Then Lonzo's coming out too. And the last Lonzo we got, let me see what the last Lonzo we got. What's this, uh, Moments card? And he was a beast too, and he's pretty cheap. Like, if he goes for, like, buyout, Lonzo's gonna be a good backup point guard. I, I'll probably pick him up. Just because I like his shot. If they keep that ugly looking shot, because that thing is cash. If they keep this same shot right here. Oh, man. He's coming out tomorrow. He's gonna be a dark matter, I'm guessing. Uh, who else? Who else is coming out tomorrow? So the Ball Brothers are coming out tomorrow because they practically confirmed it by saying, uh, speaking of tomorrow, rookie of the year plus one more family member. So it's Lonzo, get, yeah, like, confirmed. Then they leaked this, and it's Dwight Howard, if my thing would stop messing up. Mm -mm. Oh, that's a little sneak peek. They dropped this. And it's a, it's a Dwight and a blocking Dwight, which I think, I, I got like this up before the video. I think they're going to drop this same card art, but they're just going to say it's going to be like the Dark Matter. Because 2K has a history of like putting the same card art, and this card art is literally the worst card art, but they're going to add it again. Because I don't know what they're like, they're like so like horny for this, <laughs> straight up, they're horny for this uh, picture right here. I don't know, I don't know if they do it to annoy us or something, because they know that that card art is horrible. But he's coming out tomorrow. Depending on how good his card is. Because we haven't got one since like uh, his pink diamond in, in like December, November-ish. Like it's been a while. And this card right here. Point girl LeBron. Invincible Bron, bruh. Invincible Bron. You already know 99 everything. This card's going to go for like 4 mil if you pull him. It's going to be practically impossible. But you know people are going to be ripping and ripping. Like I mean ripping packs for this. I don't know. I just see that. Uh, what the heck is it called? They're going to drop some crazy. Uh, and this is just like the cards that they haven't announced. They're going to drop other cards with these cards. So you can only imagine how many budget ballers. I wouldn't be surprised if I see Isaac Banga or something like that. Because they have a history of like adding like all the good cards in one pack. I don't know what packs they're going to add. What they're going to call them. I wouldn't be surprised if say retros just because of Dwight. But man. Or fan. Oh, it could be a fan favorite. That's what it could be. Because Dwight's a fan favorite, technically speaking. That's my prediction. But those are the cards. That's what. That's why I think the market crash is going to happen tomorrow. Oh, man. But, man. I know the video was short again. I'm sorry. 
I'll try to make these longer, like explain in full depth. But like, I like keeping stuff short and simple. You know what I mean? That's just my style. Like, I don't like watching videos and then having to wait because they try to like ramble on and on. Practically, what I'm doing now, like on accident. But yeah, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll be dropping a uh, gameplay on Elvin Hayes at like three. Like as soon as he comes out, I'll be like doing a gameplay on him. Like he should be up like mad early. That I'll be wake. I'll wake up early just to uh, review all the cards. And I don't think I'm gonna do a pack opening because I really can't afford it. I'm just keeping a buck with you guys. I want to be blunt about it. But yeah, it's been your boy Lou. If you're enjoying the content and the future my for my future my team content, yeah, because I gotta speak slow because I like suck at speaking fast. But yeah, subscribe. Come on, it doesn't hurt. It's free, baby. It's free. Come on. But. It's been your boy Lou. We out to stay. Peace. I'm going to add this at the end of the video. I forgot to tell you guys. Don't sell all your LeBrons if you're going to sell it. Because it's going to be the same thing. It's just going to be at point guard for four times the price. And it's going to feel the same. Don't don't be going out there selling all your stuff. Yeah, I forgot to add. Like, tell you guys this. But, man, don't, don't do that. People are going to be panic selling. If, if anything, go sniping. Do something. Because the, the, the market is going to crash. It's probably already crashing. I haven't looked at it yet. But if people are already panicking. Uh, like, i seen DBG post something already on Twitter that he said that everybody's already panic. Uh, what the heck is called? Selling their Dark Matter bronze. Like, come on, bro. You know you know he's going to be the same price. Well, he's going to be extremely expensive. Just because he's an invincible card and he does everything. He's going to have, like, almost every batch. But just don't don't... Don't sell your cars, bro. No, don't. I'm just... I'm just trying to, like... I don't know. You guys do you. But if you are going to sell... Like, if you are going for, like, LaMelo and get... I get it. You're going to try to sell it and get, uh, like, Mad MT and all that to buy him. I understand that. But... Bron, don't don't sell your Bron. If you, unless you're going to get LaMelo or somebody like that or like Dwight. But I wouldn't recommend selling anything. I don't ever panic sell anything. At least I don't think so. I always do it just to open packs. I'm keep it like I'm telling you guys. I, I'll keep it blunt with you guys. This is at the end of the video, but I already said the intro. But peace. I just wanted to warn you guys. My bad.